Hey everybody, hey everybody, welcome to the All In Podcast. With us today, the queen of quinoa on fire in California, which is also happens to be on fire, sadly, uh, and the dictator, Chamath Palihapitiya. Uh, David Sachs will not be joining us today. He's too busy with his all, call it, all In app. Oh, I'm sorry, it's actually Colin. He put a C in front of it. No, 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 it's, the all Cal- in po- it's, it's Callan, Callan. Callan, his Callan <laughs> app, which is uh, debuted this week. Um, but Sax will be, uh, if you're a Sax stan, I think Sax is, uh, no, we've done one show without Freeberg. Now we're doing one without Sax. Yeah, this will be the Sax free episode. It is what it is. Sax free episode. All right. So we got a lot. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Oh, 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 look who joined. Look who joined. All too eager to take credit for call in on Twitter. So don't pretend like you're not part of it now. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant call in (laughs) app. The all in app. This guy creates. I hope Callan is worth a trillion dollars. (laughs) Yeah. I can't believe it. This guy is complaining that I'm leveraging the pod. Style licensing of the term all in to Sachs and gotten paid like seven million dollars in equity for him using our name oh my god i, oh I my gave god. you guys yeah. so many shout outs you know during the oh, whole shout out you did, by the way. no he did because i listened to his uh interview with uh emily chang and yeah. i listened to his thing with um axios with dan premack and oh, did he? uh he's very D- david had a very good uh uh, he was magnanimous presentation, and then he was really magnanimous and kind. So thanks, Saxy Poop. Oh, and I really? and I, I gave so much credit to Jake Al. I said that if it wasn't for Jake Al, I never would have done this whole podcasting thing because it was too hard. I never would have figured it out. Aww. And then you gave me a shout out because like of organizing it so that we could all be friends. On uh, I like yeah. that. I appreciate yeah. that. Oh, very nice. I have I actually haven't listened to it, but give us a uh, for those who don't know, David Sachs has created a podcasting slash casual audio app. It's called Call In. It's available for download for iOS. Uh, just coming out of private beta. I, my understanding is uh, you're at somewhere around 10,000 uh, folks. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of signups yesterday. I haven't got the, all the latest numbers yet, but um, but yeah, no, it's it's you know it's taking off. The, all the reviews of it have been sort of rave reviews. People are really excited about it. Um, Fantastic. But yeah, look, the concept is we're combining social audio with podcasting. We call it social podcasting. You've seen these apps where people create a room. And they have these many-to-many conversations. They tend to be ephemeral. No one really records or saves them. And the quality of the conversation, is it's a little bit chaotic. But we've taken that concept and put it in the service of creators who can now essentially like record their pod in front of a live studio audience. They can bring up the, uh, we call them callers. They can bring up people from the audience one by one to ask their questions. It's much more organized and structured. It's not a free-for-all to try and grab the mic. And then once you record the episode, you can then go into post-production in the app. You can edit the transcript in order to edit the episode, and then you publish it and you can share it. So Is it like, so it's basically like OnlyFans, but audio? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's OnlyFans, but for people who Do don't look good on camera. Do you still off at the end or no? Oh, no. <laughs> oh. Family show, family show. Family show, come on. I do. Right, I, I do when this becomes a unicorn. <laughs> oh, no. No. Blade no, is all no, getting delete, cut, delete, cut, delete, cut, delete. cut, No, not delete. It's my oh birthday my today, God damn All right. Happy yeah. birthday, Chamath. We're going Thank around you. the horn here. Everybody's patting themselves on the back. Uh, let's all take a moment to say what we like about Chamath. Okay, great. Let's get back to the episode. <laughs> that was quick. What uh, do you... You know, I was thinking about, uh, you know, d- what birthday present do I get for Jamath? And then I was like, gee, what do you get for the dictator who has everything? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what does Kim Jong-un need? <laughs> exactly. Ask, let's, hey, guys, hmm. wait, wait a second. Just, just what did they get MBS for his birthday? Hmm. Uh, hey, we don't have... Well, actually, uh, I'll tell you. Uh, uh, wine. Very rare wine. wine. Very rare wine. Very no, rare actually, wine. Th- there, there's actually an answer to that question. Apparently, Madeline Albright once got Kim jong uh, un a basketball signed by Michael Jordan for his birthday. So apparently Brilliant. that is, yeah, apparently that's what you get a dictator. Access. Yeah. You get them access, <laughs> access to people they wouldn't normally have or a bone saw. Oof. A very, Sorry. very, very old uh, French Burgundy. Uh, or Ideally could, white, but the white doesn't hold up as well. But, you know, if you go back, it, I mean, I wonder if you could drink like a, yesterday I had the two, the two fills, Deutsch and Muth. At my house, and we had uh, we drank 1996 Salon Claude de Mesnil. No, sorry, 1997 Salon Claude de Mesnil, and then we drank a bottle of 1996 Paul Roger Sir Winston Churchill Champagne. Fabulous. 
Only champagne. Um, it's fabulous. We could also get you some plenonium, uh, plenonium if you want to. Uh, <laughs> no, take, guys, guys, I don't you need to take out some enemies. We, I would like you to come and play poker next Thursday, you fuckers. And then two is just bring a bottle of, uh, bring a really nice bottle of wine or champagne. We'll drink it together. Right. That's fine. Oh my God, I got uh, cases of terrible wine. I'm going to bring them. No, you asshole. This, th- did you hear what this fucker did? <laughs> oh this my God. This fucking asshole shows you. up. I this moved. piece of shit showed up last week. And he's yeah. like, Chamath, here are these fantastic bottles. And I looked at this, they're like, 1985 Camus. And I'm like, that's not a good year. I've never right in the, the right in the garbage. Yeah. Right in so, the garbage. Wait, 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 it gets better. It gets better. Yeah. He has two bottles, yeah. and so he gives them to Joshua. And Joshua looks at them, and Joshua doesn't know what to think. And he looks at he me, and I'm, like, and I'm like, just like you know. Uh, and so Joshua's like, "Wow, David, thanks, Friedberg. This is incredible. I appreciate it." And then Friedberg does the fucking most brutal thing: open it, open it. Let's just drink oh. it And Josh was so appealed; he opened it and poured it on Chamath's <laughs> cherry tea. No one drank it. I threw it out. I threw he it took out. it he right to the herb like, garden. No, yeah. he said, "Where did you uh, find this?" He goes, "Oh, it was in my basement in the hot, temperate, humid, fucking <laughs> yeah. San Francisco yeah. weather for ten years." Yeah, I had no He's idea. Like, oh. So I moved. You know, I moved like two weeks ago and I went to the basement to like get all my boxes and I'm like, I've got like hundreds of bottles of wine that I have not seen in years. And I start yeah, going not through Not temperature controlled. Not right temperature next to the controlled. furnace. They, they weren't lying flat. I'm like, these things oh are all God. like, they're all core. They're all, they're all core. And there's like stuff Sacks. from the 80s, Josh, from the 90s. Yeah. So many a Josh took them and poured them over the arugula salad. He didn't he want to ruin like, the arugula. No, he didn't <laughs> ruin the arugula. It would ruin <laughs> the fucking <laughs> vegetables and herbs in the garden. <laughs> he, he basically cleaned so them in the drain. I'm he poured them on Chamath's windshield. Do not bring any more wine to my house. Oh my God. I'm bringing wine for your dog. If your dog's coming back with Nat, we've got My dogs are coming back today. Yeah, they're flying back from All I have to say about that game is Thank God Mr. Beast has 100 million followers on oh, YouTube. Oh. Ooh. Rest, oh. R.I.P. Mr. Beast. <laughs> all right. No, this is, all, you know, by I the way, I want to say, give a shout out Mr. To Mr. Beast, Beast is fucking incredible. He's I mean, a great, what a great, great what an incredible entrepreneur. What a yeah. great human being. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, have, I mean, for 23 years old to be that sophisticated. He's 23? 23. Dude, this guy. And I thought he was guy, 30. This guy is clearly on track to being. An enormous figure in culture. Oh, he's going to be a fucking multi, multi billionaire. He is. He is, he is determined, hardworking, smart, kind, oh, good to people, ambitious, clever, ambitious, amazing, he's got all great, and his ideas. He's creative, and he's just a good human. Mr. I really Beast the was of one yeah. of the most impressive people I have met in a really, really, really long. Totally time. agree. I mean, he yeah. and I had been texting for a long time on Twitter, and then, and then just on text. But then to finally meet him, and, and we had talked on the phone and we had Zoomed before. I'd never met him in prison, but what an incredible we should, human Oh, why don't game. we have him as the bestie guestie on the pod? He totally, have, like, he totally fit great. in with the group, too. Ugh. He was great, just funny. Yeah. You know what we should do yeah. is we should all round everybody up. We should fly to uh, to Greenville and we should surprise him. Yeah, yeah. do a little game at his house. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, here's an podcast. idea. <laughs> you no, know we could do is we could tweak Phil Helmuth and just re- have a game and replace Phil in the game with him as our new bestie. Done. Oh my god, that's great. Let's replace, <laughs> let's replace the mute. Replace the mute with Mr. Beast. Replace the mute with Mr. Beast. Kind of like a better bestie in many ways. 